Hi, this is Sammy from samnuku.com and I want to thank you for stopping by and watching this video. In this video, I wanted to discuss HostGator web hosting solutions. Now the question being that, what is it? Why do we need it? Why HostGator? And how do you go about getting it? So the first question is, what is web hosting, right? Um, Google actually defines it as the activity or a business of providing storage space and access for websites. Now, to me, that actually doesn't really clear it up, um, but I'm very much a technophobe. To me, it makes a lot more sense to compare it to something in real world. So I always thought of hosting um, is what land is to a house. Without it, you cannot have a house. In other words, if you think of a domain name, which is something we will cover in another video, um, as a house, you can think of hosting as a land. So without without the land, you can't actually put a house on it. Hopefully, that makes it just about as clear as mud. But why do you actually need it? Very simple. No hosting, no website. So hosting basically allows you to have a website. And to create an online presence, I'm pretty sure you know that you definitely need your own website. So it'll allow you basically to do business globally because you can attract customers from anywhere to your website where you have full control of what's going on. Now, why would you actually choose HostGator over any other host? Now, I'm not actually saying that HostGator is uh, a multitude better than a whole bunch of other hosts, but I can only share my experiences. So 24-7, 365 Brilliant customer service. And I use Brilliant very, very specifically because I'll tell you a funny story now, but it was ridiculously painful at the time. One day, I was actually working on a website and I just could not for the life of me know what I did, but I actually deleted my website. This is what happens when you're a technophobe trying to do technical things. So I basically tried to build a website and I was trying to create these specific pages to go in certain places, ended up deleting the entire file instead of deleting those pages that I didn't want. I was freaking out. I must have spent like, I don't know, somewhere two to three hours trying to, trying to fix it, trying to um, undo, if you will. Um, but as you can imagine, that did almost nothing. So, uh, I ended up calling HostGator. You know, I finally decided, okay, I can't waste any more time of, uh, on this. And I obviously have no idea what I'm doing. So, I called HostGator. They walked me through it step by step, how to check what I'd actually done. Um, even though they couldn't help me retrieve the site at that point in time, they basically told me, look, Sam, leave it with us and we will call you back. And I'm like, great, here we go. There's basically nothing they can do. Um, so they called me back and what they actually did was they completely restored my site from their backup servers. So in other words, you don't just get hosting with HostGator, they actually automatically back everything up for you as well, back to a certain point so that if you make a mistake like I did, you don't completely wipe out your site, they can restore you back to a certain point. For me, that was an absolute game changer in terms of sticking with HostGator and deciding on them with all my future business. So. There is absolutely value for money. You know, when I looked at it last night, just to confirm, you can actually start as low as $3.96 per month, which is um, ridiculous. It, you can get hosting cheaper than it costs to have one coffee for a whole month. So 13 years online with 99.9% uh, uptime. For those of you who are new, <coughs> pardon me, to online marketing, what that actually means in English is that 99.9% .9 of the time, your website will be online when someone chooses to visit it, right? Um, no no hosting service provider can give you a 100% uptime because there are always things happening um, in terms of servers crashing or things that they're trying to repair or improve, okay? So this is just about as good as, good as it gets. They are actually multiple award winners. Um, if you read through my blog post, which I'll put a link down below if you're not already on my blog, um, where they've actually won uh, six major awards. And I'll, I won't go into those. I'll let you have a look at them in your own time. How do you go about getting HostGator? It's actually really simple. Joining HostGator can be can be done in three minutes. All you need to do is go to www.hostgator.com. Um, the link is actually down below in the description or in the actual blog post itself, um, and follow the prompts of actually joining. Alternatively, if you need help signing up to HostGator, all you need to do is watch the video that I put at the bottom of this blog post that actually shows you step by step how to join HostGator. Um, without any glitches, okay? I thank you very much for stopping by and watching this video. I appreciate your time. I hope you have a great day. If you're watching this on YouTube, please like, share, comment, 
subscribe to the channel if you're watching this anywhere else and then please do the same as it as it applies to that platform on my blog post go ahead and subscribe so you don't miss out on any other kick-ass content like this and if you're on my mailing list i appreciate you very much you guys are the bloodline of my business take care we'll talk soon